PeaceWrestling.com. I'm here backstage next. Oh, Hacksaw Jim Duggan. Hey, well, excuse me for interrupting you, brother, but I've been looking all over for my 2x4, and I can't find it nowhere. But I'm going to need it this Saturday at Torrington High School because I know some of those young boys, I said some of those young boys are going to make a move for Hacksaw Jim Duggan. Well, let me tell you young boys something. I've got a partner that's going to be watching my back. I'm not a hard man to find. If you want a piece of hacksaw, Jim Duggan, like the game show host says, come on down, tough guy. Give me a hoe, young man. Oh, you got to work on that hoe, kid. Ho! You You Where's my two by What a match that was. I'm awaiting Brian Anthony. Come on, my friend. Two times in a night. Wow. A little less confident here. Oh, boy. What do you have to say? What do I have to say? That match wasn't even fair. Hacksaw Jim Duggan was cool about 20 years ago. You know, people said he spent the whole day, the whole week, the whole month training for Brian Anthony. But I don't think he was training at all. I could barely stand the smell of him. He smelled like Ben Gay, and I think the only training he did was sitting on the curb outside the convenience store eating Swim Jims and Corn Nuts. I didn't even want to get close to him, so let me make a proclamation right now. Next week in Torrington... Hey, hey, hey Brian Anthony, what happened tonight? You claim to be the champion of all wrestling? You claim to be the greatest? Well, let me tell you something. As far as I'm concerned, you're not even the champion in tiddlywinks. But the bottom line is this. And the bottom line, people, you need to understand next Saturday night. You and I, we're on the same team against Hacksaw Jim Duggan and Bull Dread. And they happen to have Torrington Mayor Ryan Bingham in his corner. I may be retiring, but there's one thing I need to do before I quit, and that's a bench. That humiliation that I had last year, you need to be on your game next Saturday night. Will you show up? Listen, I'm not the one who's made a 10-year career out of losing. Don't worry about Brian Anthony showing up, because I show up ready to go every second of my life. You're the one that needs to show up. Saturday night, Torrington, Connecticut. Don't miss it.